Hello guys, my name is Fox and welcome to part 25 of Fox Direct Nix 2 Horse Lord series. Let's continue. So, in the previous episode, we've just been uh, conquering one by one provinces in the European region. We got Luki, we got Chad. Uh, and also, now our truce is up with Denmark because they changed the ruler. Uh, so now we can declare a war on Denmark again. That's what I'm gonna be doing. And also, I decided that it's probably already time for us to uh, get rid of the Cotton and uh, Cotton and Croran, if possible. So I'm also sending an army in here uh, to do that. So hopefully we're gonna be able to destroy them too. And we could use our High Dachi, which seems like not a reasonable idea at all. We're not gonna be doing this. Uh, we could pillage some stuff for a lot of gold. Yes, please. Uh, how's our upgrade in the capital? Still being constructed, okay. So, uh, my new wife is pregnant. Awesome. Uh, Denmark, what kind of CP do we have against you? Couple of conquests, subordination of Kola for one province, sub subordination of Karelia for two provinces. Invasions we are, could not declare, subjugation... Uh, uh, eh. So, I think what I'm gonna do is just uh, declare a conquest for this province, then it's gonna open me possibility to attack this guy who is Nidaurus. And then we're gonna feed some more lands to this guy in here. Or actually... Oh, we could actually also eat Colon Revolt. Uh, why do this first? Uh, let's go and do this first. Because... Uh, they're gonna... They're probably gonna go away soon, so... Let's try to have this opportunity. I can think that they only have one province. Sieging it down should be enough to... Uh, Sieging it down should be enough to just finish the war. Which is gonna be great. And actually it's gonna give us opportunity to take Nidaris even without taking this province. And then we probably would be able to just declare... Uh, the sink for prestige and take these two holdings in one war. That's gonna be probably better. Okay, 100%. Thanks for revolting and giving me the opportunity to kill you. Uh, 50 gold in here. Yes, please. 25 in here. And you're gonna receive come something. Mm, now, why is this border? Okay, I don't know what, just, uh, what I've just done. Oh, I probably gave you just a uh, tribal holding. Okay. You receive the county as well then. That's better. Now, on the Denmark. On the Denmark. I'm probably just gonna declare a subordination of Corellia and give this uh, two provinces. 300 prestige. We have tons of that, so yeah, why not? And let's call in our vassals. Because Denmark is relatively big, so they could be a problem. Also, we already have 100% with Buddhists. Let's finish that. And we're probably just gonna assault this just for the supply limit reasons. Oh, only 3% for this one province? That's interesting. Or it's not expected, and 7% for this in total. But at least now we're gonna start getting ticket war score. Oh, and also, we have some relatively sizable alliance in here. Okay. Oh, Saxony? What are you doing in here? And all of these guys? Yeah, that's definitely a, a lot bigger than. It was in the previous war, but still not big enough to kill me, so I'm just gonna destroy your armies one by one, and you're gonna give up anyway. Uh, our wife is dead again, died during the childbirth, god damn it, and it's also only a daughter. Such a waste of a woman. Uh, let's get someone who is probably decent age. 
Weak ones. Uh, and no. You. Sounds fine. Uh, could you please stop running away from me, you idiot? Great Dutch of Ugra. Good job. Sense for losing this battle. Oh. It still costs not that much in war score. Yeah, probably because of the size of this alliance. He thinks that. Uh, but he's powerful. But compared to all of my vassals, you are nothing. You could pillage some more. Yes, let's do this. And this as well. Okay, now it's gone. That's a lot better. No more revolt risk, no more Buddhists. That's great. Also, our army in here is on their place. So, who's gonna receive this, receive this lands? They are all pretty much uh, feudal. And my people are not gonna be smart enough to deal with them properly. So it doesn't really matter. I think I could give one to Mushte and one to this guy, to Uzur. Because I think that the CBA could have the subordination of this place here, yeah, taking two provinces. So one of them gonna go to this guy, one of them gonna go to this guy. Yeah, sounds great. And we need to call in all of our vassals into this war as well. Royal marriage. My niece and your brother, my brother-in-law. Okay. And I think we could even try to assault these holdings too. They're gonna be a little bit uh, more fortified than, than the tribal ones. But only 700 defenders, so it's not gonna be a problem. And 100%. Great. That's actually... I love quick wars. So. First of all, burning everything down. Or all we can. Also, you're not supposed to be my vassal. Uh, just... Okay, so we have city, we have county. So I give away your county. And... Oh, I couldn't revoke it uh, quite yet, because I'm not his leash. But now I could. Now give me the... Oh. No, never mind. Revoke the city too. Okay, now we could pillage. I think we're gonna pillage. Oh, doesn't matter. Now it's gone. So now this thing should be considered as a nomadic... Uh, Counts because it only have one holding, so I'm gonna give it to Mujde, so they probably gonna have some power because they're so dumb, as I already said a million of times. But that's not all, or it's always great to remember, right? Uh, I no, I don't want to revoke, I want to give you something. Croran, sounds great. Now you have three, yeah, now you should be happy. And this thing just gonna go to you, Uzur. You're gonna receive Kumol. Okay. I hope you're happy now. Now we could go for Khotan, I guess. So now, how's the war in here? We're trying to resiege. That's not acceptable. Oh, my vassal's gonna deal with that. Sounds great enough. Mm, any other armies? Anywhere? Not really. And if even if they are around here, uh, too much pop-ups. Buddhists, what the hell are you doing? Oh, in our newly conquered province. Okay, let's call in our vassals. Actually, we have our army in here. Okay, I guess I could deal with that. Also, we could probably use some commanders in here, but they're actually. Uh, never mind. They're all mostly in charge already. Uh, you want to join my court? Yeah, why not? And I won't give up. 16th of March, 21th of March. Okay. i just follow you to here. How's the war there? Uh, don't let me force... Or don't force me to suffer attrition. Please, let's go to this province. Because it looks like I have a lot more supply limit. And even if they are all gonna pile on me, it's gonna be better. Go destroy this 400 stack. Gonna be a lot more useful. There is our 
put this revolt finished, we could pillage again. And we probably could already get one more upgrade in the capital. Get ourselves a yum. Yes, please. Some more trade post limit and some more points for uh, economical points. Yeah. We already bumped. Actually, we already have level 1 on everything. Level 1 trade practices. I don't know what I'm going to be bumping in the next. When I'm going to have the chance, but we'll see. Uh... Oh, do we want to be ransomed? Anyone want to be ransomed? Yeah, some children could be ransomed from the Kroron. Actually, tons of children. It's unfortunate that you could not send all the requests at the same time. Because you need to wait for... For the ransomer to decide if he wants to pay or not. Oh, I just need to send them all one by one. Okay, come on. I saw one, two more in here. Why do you have so much children? And they all look pretty much the same, and they're all girls. That's weird. Do you have a cloning machine? So, um, last one should be somewhere in here. Yeah. Go away, give me some more money to upgrade my glorious capital. Uh, this guy need to be dead, if possible. I want my son wants to become zealous. Oh uh, yeah, why not? Have thirteen k army marching around there, uh, and now it's gonna be a lot lower on the troop counts, <laughs> considering that the supply limit here on is only two thousand. Okay, Denmark, could you please already surrender? You have no chances. Against me. Guys, just, just assault this holding and it's gonna be fine. Don't sit in here suffering attrition. No, you are too, too stupid for that, right? Okay, we could pillage again. Let's do this. And could we upgrade our trade, for, uh, trade post at all? Not really. Nope. Nope, okay. And nothing else I think could be upgraded at all. Also, this army need to go to Khotan, because we need to conquer it as well. Battle of Raivola. Awesome. Mm, we lost our steward. Let's get a new one, and you're gonna be... Uh, you're gonna be doing this thing. Why not here? Go. Go do stuff. And our courtship lane, first of all, we do not have better one, okay, you're gonna be just researching cultural tech in the capital. Just because uh, personalization not gonna work out, really. Also, Denmark is being sieged by someone else, looks like. The Schaldander Revolt. Great. Don't you want to surrender yet? Not really, okay. I could always just wait for the second war score. Mm, 80% for me to become ambitious. <laughs> and of course it did not work out. 80% chance, really? That's unfortunate. But we're already 70, so it doesn't matter. We're gonna die soon. Uh, also our heir, our son, have no children. That's unfortunate. Could we recall you to court? Uh, no. Well, that's unfortunate. Because I want him to fornicate, just for us to have more possible heirs. Also, our blood oath oh, is done again. Let's get a new one. With whom? Akun. Do you want to have a blood oath? Yes, you do. Let's go into this. And we did. Natural death at the age of 70. Okay, sounds fine. Now we are back from our mercenary duties and all the stuff needs to be reworked a little bit. Okay, first of all, the royal marriage. Uh, with someone with decent trait, like quick maybe. We already have quick. Maybe any strong? 
No. No strong women in our court, unfortunate. But I just saw someone with a beaut oh, with a beautiful one, or how the hell you call it, attractive, right? Mm, let's go sort by age. Thirteen and quick. Maybe someone who is closer. Mm, not really. Three years to wait. We already forty-three. Eh. No. I think our own uh, quick trade gonna be enough. Minus 300 prestige from Marion into the... Okay, let's not marry the Baron. Maybe some daughter of... Of the Khan. Like this girl. Yeah, that's gonna be better. So, let's get you. Gold or prestige? Prestige this time. And also we need uh, tons of concubines. All the possible ones we could find. Maybe even with genetical traits, if it's possible at all. 32 and attractive sounds great. A little bit old, but still could be used for a little bit of time. Like 10 years, 13 years. Uh, okay, uh, uh, other ones just gonna be the young ones. With no real uh, traits. Okay, that's fine. Now, unmarried heir, our half brother, let's get you a wife as well. You, we could actually give this one girl who are quick and 13, if I could find her in here. Uh, this one. Yeah, marrying into Baron, but should be fine. A new ambition. Yeah, let's try to have a son. And our half brother needs education. Let's go and educate you myself. We could recall all of the guys into the war again. And everything else seems to be fine. What about our relations in here? Uh, could we now have, have a blood of this Alcun? Yes, we still ca uh, can, so let's go and have it secured. A relations improvement. Uzer is the lowest one. So let's go and work on them. Our Chancellor could be probably changed. Why do you hate me? And why is it not hovering over this button? I don't know. Uh, let's actually get this one. He's 15 at he is hating me a little bit less, so... Improve clan sentiment. Oh, our marshal is pretty great. You're gonna be... Training troops in the capital. You are fine, you're gonna be overseeing construction. Spy master is fine, you're gonna be stealing technology from Constantinople. And court chaplain gonna be researching cultural tech. Okay. Everything seems to be done in proper way. Denmark still losing their war, which is not a surprise. We could pillage some more, but not not for 10 gold. Okay, this army for the cotton has arrived. I just think we're gonna declare conquest of cotton and just gonna give it to Mujde. Oh, 6,000 troops. That's... A little bit too much. You should not be hiring so much, you idiot. It's not gonna help you anyways. Actually, I should be calling in my vassals, I guess. Before declaring this war, because I have an army va uh, vassal army attached to me. And I think if I weren't... If I were not... Uh, called them in, pro uh, I probably might have lost, lost the battle. Because they wouldn't be the part of it. Okay, give the lands. Oh, there's a lot of holdings. Maybe I should actually keep it for myself and try to pillage it down as much as possible and then give it to Mushte. So just so they're gonna have more holdings. Actually, they're not even complaining about having so few. Uh, so I'm just gonna give it right away. I guess we're gonna take 
10 gold from it because we can't have more. Oh, that should be fine. And you're gonna receive Hotan. Not Barony, Counts of Hotan with all the lower titles. Also. Uh, why is this Barony still controlled by me? I don't want it to be controlled by me, so... The Barony... Hmm... That's strange. Barony of Dundal Yulkil. Why can't I give you this Barony? Okay, mm what about... Actually, these guys are your direct vassal, so I should be able to give it to you. Okay, let's go and create a new vassal, and then we're just gonna... Oh. That is really strange. Now he's... Okay, now he's vassal. And everything should be fine. Yeah, fine with me. Uh, with the Croran we have a... We do not have a truce because we changed our character. Okay. So, could we just eat you completely? We could declare separate nation. We do not have as much prestige as our previous uh, previous char character had. Also, this Buddhist uprising is really freaking huge. Let's go and deal with that first. Uh, this guy wants to kill someone. Uh, please don't. Mm, actually, not to pl not plot to kill, just end the plot. And actually, it is already time for me to have a break, guys. So looks like the war with Denmark probably gonna be done in the next episode. And we're just gonna keep expanding wherever we can. So if you enjoyed watching this, you could leave a like. If you want to see more, you could subscribe. And if you want to leave a comment, you should definitely do it. And I would answer as soon as I could. See you later, guys. Bye bye.